Governor Tim Walz and state health officials say the first Minnesotans who will get the new coronavirus vaccine in the initial wave could get their shots as early as Christmas week. Minnesota is poised to get 46,800 doses of the Pfizer vaccine next week, followed by 136,000 doses of the Moderna vaccine in the two weeks after that, for a total of 183,400 within the first month. This is a light at the end of the tunnel that there is going to be procedures that can be put in place. Minnesota has worked hard on this. You've heard me say it time and time again. We were one of the model states that was used by the CDC and other states to how you do this, and we're prepared and ready to go. We're here to say this is really a good thing that President Trump and Vice President Pence and our governor and the four leaders here have all said that the virus or the vaccine coming out today and, and, and how we're going to implement it is really good news because we all can agree that this will be the end of kids out of school. This will be the end of all these businesses shut down. Whether we disagreed about how those things happen, this is the hope in the future. Minnesotans can have a great deal of confidence that this uh, vaccine development and distribution is being done in accordance with science. It is not a partisan political exercise, and the four of us are here today to say that the vaccine distribution is not a political issue and that this is something that we all uh, share together the, the hope that this is the beginning of the end of the pandemic having its hold on Minnesota and by getting the vaccine is how we will get to the other side. The whole thing about this particular event was to see the fact that we had four legislative leaders agreeing with the governor that the vaccine is really important and that we want to encourage people to take it. And particularly if you're older, uh, this will be a lifesaver. Uh, and that's where, you know, most of the people are dying. And this is just a critical moment. And I wanted to show support of the governor. Minnesota will follow federal guidance directing the first doses to health care personnel and long-term care facility residents. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.